Orchids are hard to grow. So people throwing out sentences like that, I find that it's immediately you're putting a wrench into anybody's ambition to want to get into orchids. Now, everything is hard to grow. As far as I'm concerned, if you don't care for it properly, <laughs> I mean, you don't care for your pets properly, then you're going to have all sorts of issues and off to the vet you go. And I would like to debunk this. I don't want to say orchids are hard to grow. I think that many people who believe this to be true, then we're not going to get that many people to actually become involved in orchid growing. I find that we make the mistake from the moment that we buy orchids. That's when it becomes a problem. I had a huge monstera outside on the landing of my home in Kenya. It was massive. It was growing up into the tree. I don't remember what kind of a tree it was. I know it wasn't a palm tree, but it was growing up and the leaves were so big and it was just growing all over the place. Now, this one was just out in the garden doing its thing and growing roots like, you know, Tarzan could be swinging through them. So that plant was obviously in its happy place. Bring that to our environment and you're going to have a really hard time growing it. And the same with orchids. I find they're not hard to grow. It's up to us to do our research. And yes, we can still get it wrong. I have bitten off more than I could chew when it came to my vandas and then certain mistakes were made. That is normal, but that doesn't make orchids hard to grow. The people that have cold growing environments, they will do fabulously, for example, with some of the zygote petalums out there and even some more cold tolerant slipper orchids, neos, etc, etc. Whereas, and Rinko stylus, my nemesis, <laughs> which I would love to grow as well. But yeah, so I don't believe orchids are hard to grow. I think we need to be more aware, self-aware of what our capabilities are and accept the fact that times change, circumstances change and notice how our collection evolves under those changes even if we have less time we will understand that some orchids can handle what we can provide and some orchids can't and then we can focus on the kinds that do well given the circumstances that we have and get more of those or along those lines.